All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's time to get cooking. Okay, we're gonna make us some guac. Oh yeah, time to get some tasty guac. Mwah. Okay, for this recipe, you're gonna need some avocados, some pepper, some salt, some sour cream, some lime or lemon juice, whatever you can find, just some of the citrus variety, and some Aero Tabasco. Yep, this is, this is my version of guacamole. Won't be it like everyone else's. It's got my own little fang to it. But yeah, it should be nice to try out. All right, let's get going. Yeah, we're gonna make this super easy guac. I make, I make this guac all the time when I need to. We're gonna use a little blender. That's right, we're gonna use this blender to chop up our guac. Now first things first, let's cut our avocado, okay. Now you want to be careful cutting avocados. A lot of people always cut themselves while they're doing it, so you want to be careful. You want to make sure you cut nicely into these avocados. Now you can always tell a good avocado just by how soft, by how soft it is. Okay, see how nice and easy that cut in. All right, now the unveiling moment. Oh yeah, check it out. Oh yeah, this is the good stuff, baby. Now you want to use a spoon for this. Now you're going to need a plate for get all the scraps. Now get out, make sure you get your pip out. Oh, check, look how easy that came out. Before you, though, before you put it in, an easy way to make sure you can get out all the goodness we've got, you just put some little cuts in. Don't cut very hard, just nice little cuts. You want to go too hard? Yeah, you just want a nice, nice, long, easy cuts in it, just like this. Just makes it easy to get out. See? Boom. Oh, look at that deliciousness. Oh, yeah. Now this is going to be a three avocado recipe. So you're going to need three avocado. Or you can just change it up, make whatever you want. Make your cuts and slowly slide in your spoon and pop out it comes. Oh yeah. And that's the shit. Make sure. Yeah. Look at that perfect. Okay now. Turn that in our sour cream. One tablespoon, this is what I've chosen for this recipe. Three avocados, one tablespoon of sour cream in. You're gonna need that. Now, a couple of jolts of Tabasco for that heat. Okay, anyway, just go on. A couple of little drops in, just like that. Add as much as you want, depending on how much, on how much hot you want your guacamole. I like it with a little bit of kick, so I like to throw a little bit of jumps in. No one's better than a little bit of spice in my guac. Alright, now we gotta crack in our pepper. A couple of turns, that's all you need. That's it. And some salt. I use ionized sea salt. Sea salt's the best of the salts. Get a little bit of iodine stuff into your diet. Very important. Especially when you're going up ready. You don't want too much. Just want about, you know, a couple of little shakes. Like that. That's all you need. Okay. Alright, and now the final bit, one of the I think one of the most crucial bits is probably the, the lime or lemon. I've, I had lemons around the house, so I'm going to use lemon. But this adds a, a beautiful kick to any other, any good guac. Just want to squeeze all the juice in there. Make sure we get it all out. Oh, yeah. The Blend it up. 
German, perfectly made, like 10 minute guac, perfect, delicious. Mm. Takes about only a few minutes of preparation, cut them up some avocado, cut up a lemon or lime, some juice it, that's about it, ladies and gentlemen. It's my, it's my own guac. Mm. Subscribe to my channel, also check out my gaming channel, my gaming channel, Punch Before Munch. You know, I play a few games, mess around a bit. Kind of like this one, except without food and music. But see what you think. Anyway, see you. See you. Enjoy the quad, baby. Mm, I know I will.